Hello, everyone. This is Rob Leyenberger. I'm the office, director of the Office of Research and Standards in the Office of Generic Drugs. And it's my pleasure to give the closing remarks for today's session. It's been a fantastic meeting. We heard from great external speakers in the sessions and panels that I was able to be a part of. We had a fascinating discussion. So I'd really like to thank, first of all, all of the attendees who have been participating and listening, making comments. And we hope that you understand better some of the challenges that face generic drug development. And we also hope that this meeting has stimulated you to think what's your personal input into the research priorities. And we hope that you will use the public docket to share those remarks and comments with us so that we can capture all of them as we move forward with identifying our research priorities for the generic drug program at FDA. So thank you to all the, all the attendees. I also want to specifically thank all of our industry and academic and non-FDA participants as speakers and panelists who have participated in this meeting. You are a critically important part of this because you are the people we're trying to hear from. From FDA standpoint, we, you know, we hear from ourselves a lot, but this is an opportunity for us to hear from you and bring those diverse perspectives into our decision-making process. So we really value the time that you've spent with us here, the time you've spent in preparing and thinking about this, and we you know, deeply, deeply appreciate that participation from all of the industry and academic members of the panel who have participated in this, and we hope that all the attendees have learned from the discussions that have happened. You know, I also want to thank the FDA staff that have participated in organizing this meeting, especially Sam Rennie, who's done the leadership in getting everything together, but also all of our different session chairs and breakout session leaders and the FDA speakers who have brought our voice to this discussion. We hopefully have tried to, you know, to bring to both our stakeholders who want to comment and our attendees what the FDA's perception of some of these challenges are. So I really appreciate the time that all of the FDA staff have brought to the content here in making this a, you know, a useful exercise in helping stimulate that kind of creative thinking for developing our future research program. And all of the staff members from FDA who are here and who are listening, right, will be taking this back and saying, all right, that's actually a problem I think I can solve and here's how I want to do it. So we appreciate this meeting as catalyzing those type of interactions. And finally, I want to thank our collaborators from the SBIA group at FDA who have made, done all of the logistics for this meeting. They've, you know, they've done the publicity, getting that website, getting that information available. They're the ones that are going to make all of these things available through YouTube videos, the slide presentations you can get from the website, all of that. Eventually, we'll, we'll also have the transcripts available as well. So we want to thank all of the staff, the SBIA and Jeff Kelly especially for his hosting and behind the scenes work, Brenda Stoddard for helping organize this. Really appreciate their participation in this, in all of the aspects of making this event flow very smoothly. And so I believe that they may have some, you know, some the, the, they may have some final housekeeping slides from the SBI staff. But I just like to conclude by thanking everyone for participating in this. And it was a fantastic day. Thank.